By the end of this video, you're going to know the right way to set up your descriptions on YouTube, your tags on YouTube, and a few other settings that are going to help you increase the amount of views that you're getting or the amount of money that you're making on YouTube right now. Because it could be your description that's actually scaring people away from watching your content, and that's why your videos aren't getting views. Okay, so for starters, I have no idea who this content creator is, but he's a small content creator that I saw with a few mistakes. So if we look at his description initially, it is incredibly long. I mean, this might be the longest description. I've actually ever seen on YouTube. So we're going to click show less right here and a few things that he's doing wrong. First and foremost, he has his link showing immediately. I would not have your link showing immediately in your description because if you do that, it is going to scare viewers away. It takes away your intention of the video, which could be to entertain people or to educate people. But instead, now people think that you're trying to sell them something. So I would strongly suggest that you do not do this. Instead, you want to set up your descriptions like this. You need one to three sentences right here that have keywords that are going to show up here. For example, the keyword I'm trying to write for here is blow up on TikTok. So if we type blow up in here, it's showing both in my title, in my description, and I also have it showing within my tags. And you need to make sure that you do the same exact thing. In fact, if we do this, it shows in the tags five different times. So you need to make sure that first and foremost, your description begins begins with one to three sentences. From there, you can add in whatever links you want. You could add in chapters, you could add in timeframes. All that stuff is really good. But the most important part here is that your description, your title, and your tags all have the keywords that you're trying to rank for because this is what YouTube is going to actually look for when they try to determine whether or not they should actually push out your content. Now, the cool thing is it's actually a tool that makes this incredibly easy and that's gonna be vidIQ's Chrome extension. So if we come right here and click get description, what this will do is it's going to look at the transcript of the video and it is gonna build you out a few different descriptions. And if you don't like the description that it built out for you, you can literally just click refresh and it'll make you a new one. So it made this one, made this one, made this one, and that made my job super easy. In addition, you can come in and customize it. You could change it to a different language. You could change it to a different tone. You could add excitement. You can make it longer. You can make it shorter. This leverages basically ChatGPT to make the perfect description for your video. In addition to that, if we scroll down, again, this is with vidIQ's Chrome extension, which by the way, you could get at the pinned comment below for just $1 for the first 30 days. It's an absolute no-brainer because it makes getting the right description, getting the right tags, even getting the right title really simple because you could type in one of your own titles or you could look at all the different suggestions that they have. And again, you could customize this based off so many different things. Now, I'm going to scroll down here and you're going to see exactly how this tags feature works. So basically, this has a bunch of tags right here. These are the amount of characters that show in the tag. You want this to be either 450 to really close to 500. You can't go over 500, but you also don't want too few tags. And these aren't the only tags you need to be concerned about on YouTube. I'm going to show you other ones in just a second. So this right here, if we come down here, you'll see the different tags that we could add. So we could add this in and then from here. Well, obviously it's not going to let us do that, but we're going to exit out. And then if you click refresh tags, it's actually going to show you other tags. But more importantly, if we come to another video, so this video is about how to blow up on TikTok. So what I'm going to do, how to blow up on TikTok, and I'm going to see if there are any competitors videos here. So this guy's going to be a competitor. I'm going to go down here and we're going to be able to see a few different things under here. First and foremost, if I come over here, come under overview, this is going to show me his channel tags, which you need to make sure are set up on your channel and it's going to show the video tags. So I can literally just copy these video tags and put them into mine. And guess what? It's going to help me rank for search the same way that he was able to rank for search. Now, when it comes to these channel tags right here, I did want to show you this because it's pretty cool. If you come into settings on YouTube and you you come over here, come under channel, you'll be able to add in a bunch of different channel tags. I recommend that whatever you're trying to rank for on search, you add in here, you add in your own name, and you add in a name to a few different competitors. In addition to that, if we come under upload defaults right here, you're actually going to be able to add in all the different links that you might put in every single one of your descriptions. And then what's gonna happen is when you then go to put a description on YouTube, it's going to automatically populate all that so you don't have to copy and paste those links every single time. Now, here's the last and most important thing you need to make sure that you're doing in your content. In fact, this creator didn't do this and wasn't able to take advantage of this. And again, 
he didn't set up his description correctly. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to come down to this video right here and you'll see what I did in this video. And this is why this video is going to take over all those other videos in search. Now what we're going to do is scroll down. I have a pinned comment here. So you need to make sure you're setting up your description correctly. It looks like I'm just trying to educate the viewer. I have nothing to sell them. I have nothing to promote to them. But also if you do have something to promote, like an affiliate link, like a free course, like something you're selling, like consulting. It could be anything. It could just be you want people to subscribe. You need to be putting it in the pinned comment. So your link should be showing up after the fold in your description and in the pinned comment. And this is going to skyrocket the amount of people that watch your videos, the amount of people that convert to paying customers, and the amount of people that end up subscribing to your content. Now, obviously, just making the right description isn't the only thing you need to do right on YouTube. You also need to make sure that you're creating content on the right topics, you're using the right titles, and so much more. So if you're struggling with growing on YouTube and you want to learn how I can help you get more views, get more subscribers, or even monetize your channel quicker, well, please check out this video right here that walks through exactly how I can audit your channel. We could hop on a phone call to discuss any problems you have or anything like that so I can help you grow quicker on YouTube. If that's interesting, well, I'll see you over there.